Before we start our story today, please like and subscribe to our channel, it will help the channel grow and we could bless more to our charity organization in need. And thank you for your support. Who is Patron, the little four-legged warrior honored by Ukraine's President Zelensky? Patron has so far detected more than 200 explosives, according to Ukrainian claims, potentially saving dozens of lives and preventing serious injuries. Ukraine's President Volodymyr Zelensky on Sunday, May 8, presented a medal to Patron, Ukraine's famous mind-sniffing dog, and his owner for their services to the nation since the Russian invasion began on February 24. Patron has so far detected more than 200 explosives, according to Ukrainian claims, potentially saving dozens of lives and preventing serious injuries, and has become a canine symbol of Ukrainian patriotism. Zelensky honored Patron, barking and constantly wagging his tail, and his owner, Major Mihailo Aliyev of Civil Protection Service, at a news conference in Kiev with Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. Today, I want to award those Ukrainian heroes who are already clearing our land of mines. And together with our heroes, a wonderful little sapper via Patron, who helps not only to neutralize explosives, but also to teach our children the necessary safety rules in areas where there is a mine threat," the president said. Patron's, patron's story The little white Antan Jack Russell Terrier is deployed in the northeastern city of Chernihiv close to Ukraine's border with Belarus, which Russia put under siege and subjected to heavy shelling for almost six weeks before retreating. Ukrainian sappers are continuing to sweep up munitions and defuse mines as the city limps back to a semblance of normality. One day, Patron's story will be turned into a film, but for now, he is faithfully performing his professional duties, Ukraine's Center for Strategic Communications tweeted along with a video on March 19, by when the sniffer dog had already helped defuse more than 90 explosives. Rise to Fame Patron, whose name has been translated into English as ammo or cartridge, also acts as a mascot of the country's state emergency service, SES. He frequently appears in videos on official Ukrainian social media channels, and in illustrations, toys, and knitted replicas made by his fans all over the country. A popular sketch shows him urinating on a Russian missile wearing his signature safety vest, the BBC reported, another has him against a split background, with a ball in a park, and with a bombed building behind him. While Patron has admirers around the world, a report in the New York Times observed that his rise to fame may be part of Ukrainian efforts to control the war's narrative with viral messaging. The report observed that dramatic wartime tales have been a critical part of the country's information strategy, and Patron's videos on CISA's Facebook page have got hundreds of thousands of views. The, Ukra the Ukrainian strategy around Patron has been to leverage the internet's innate love for dog-slash-cat videos, combined with the sentiments of sympathy and solidarity for the country in many places around the world to develop proactive narratives and strengthen Ukraine's image. The videos have been accompanied by clever messaging, on Sunday, as Prime Minister Trudeau patted his pockets in a jokey show of looking for a doggy treat for Patron, the SES reported that the dog was extremely pleased to meet a true friend of Ukraine, even though Mr. Trudeau did not find a piece of Patron's favorite cheese. Dogs and Wars Dogs have been used to sniff out bombs, mines, and explosives at least since World War II. Today, dogs are used by security forces in conflict zones almost everywhere in the world including in India. A dog has a sense of smell that is far more evolved than that of humans, and they can, with training, sniff out explosives in landmines or in metal or plastic casing. A dog has an olfactory zone that is 40 times that of humans, its nose goes all the way to the back of its throat, and contains approximately 300 million receptor cells, compared to about 6 million in humans. According to an essay in Smithsonian Magazine, 35% of a dog's brain is assigned to smell-related operations, by contrast, only about 5% of the cellular resources of the human brain are dedicated to smelling. Although Patron is a Jack Russell Terrier, the most effective sniffer breeds are considered to be German Shepherds, Belgian Molinoises, 
and Labrador Retrievers. President Volodymyr Zelensky has routinely ended his nightly wartime addresses by announcing, announcing state awards for Ukraine's soldiers. On Sunday, he honored a fighter who is perhaps the country's smallest, a little dog named Patron. Patron, whose name means ammo in Ukrainian, helps sniff out Russian mines and explosives in the northeastern city of Chernihiv and acts as a mascot of the country's state emergency service. The dog has found more than 200 explosive devices and was taught pyrotechnic work by his owner, Mikhail Uliev of the Civil Protection Service, Mr. Zelensky said. Patron's rise to fame may be another facet of Ukrainian efforts to control the war's narrative with viral messaging, experts have said that dramatic wartime tales are critical parts of the country's information strategy. So at the age of six months, Patron began to get training. The idea at the time was to use Patron to show off the kinds of skills that dogs could learn. But soon after Russia attacked Ukraine, it became clear that Patron could help with far more serious work. Patron is now trained to sniff out gunpowder. This means that he's able to detect bombs and other devices that can explode. After Russian forces pulled back from areas in northern Ukraine, Ukrainian soldiers discovered that the Russians had left behind lots of mines. Working with Mr. Ilyev, Patron now helps Ukraine's emergency service find and remove mines left behind by Russian soldiers. He works mainly in the city of Chernihiv. So far, Patron has found 236 mines. After Patron locates a mine, soldiers trained in handling explosives can safely remove it. It's hard and dangerous work. But Patron is a happy dog and helps others keep going, even when times are tough. He can inspire anyone, says Mr. Ilyev. Pictures and videos of Patron at work, wearing his protective jacket have spread on the internet. The little dog has become extremely famous in Ukraine. People across the country have begun to send in artwork with their drawings of him. Some people have even knitted stuffed animals that look like Patron. Children seem to especially love the little dog. Several pictures have been posted of smiling children holding or petting him. Last month, Patron made a visit to a children's hospital in the country's capital, Kiev. Ukraine's government is using Patron in another way, to help children understand that they need to be careful around mines. It's a sad reality that children in parts of Ukraine need to be aware of mines, and be extremely careful if they see anything that looks like a mine. It's not all work for Patron, though. He is reported to be very fond of having his belly rubbed. And Mr. Ilyev says, Patron just loves cheese. But still, a young, very active dog gets tired. So it's not surprising that, during a meeting with reporters on Sunday, Patron did what came naturally and fell asleep. Thank you for watching and see you again for another interesting facts and stories.